Hi everyone. In this video, I will talk about week eight summary, and I will explain what we will do during this week. As you know, now we started topic number two: analyze and use the proportional relationships. In topic number two, we have six lessons. We have a six lessons. Let me open topic number two. In topic number two, we will start from connect ratios, rates, and unit rates. This lesson already done. Determine unit rates with ratio of fractions. Also, this one already done. Understand proportional relationships. After rates, unit rates, and ratios, okay, we will try to study and understand proportional relationships as a direct proportional or inversely proportional and we will explain all relationships of a proportional and then we will describe a proportional relationships in lesson 2.4 in this week in this week we will start from 15 october from sorry from 22 october from lesson 2.4 2.3 in this week we have two goals. So by the end of this lesson, you have to be able to determine whether the quantities are proportional by testing for equivalent ratios. Okay, by equivalent ratios. If you check this lesson, as you know, we have a tutorial one. In this video, you can understand how we can take the proportion relationships. Also, this video will help you to understand proportional relationships. And after tutorial one, we have interactivity one. In this activity, we will check some proportionals and some relationships. After interactivity one, if you didn't understand any question or if you cannot solve any question, you can watch a tutorial two. In this video, the same lesson, the same topic, the same subject, okay? And in this video, they're trying to explain our lesson by using a different way. By the end of this video also, you can check the interactivity too. Here we have some lessons to evaluate yourself, to check yourself. And also here, this block, we have a further practice, okay, to evaluate yourself again. And if you need more questions, you will find a self-assessment. And it will be very nice if you check this question, challenging question, because as I told you before, all of my students, perfect. And this student, this question for all of them. So by the end of each lesson, I try to check the challenging equations. And the next day also, October 23, we will talk again about the same lesson. We will stay with the same lesson to take more questions, to practice more and more, to understand everything in this lesson. As you know, 24 October, we have A1 summative assessment. I explained everything about this assessment. Also, I shared the study guide of this assessment. Several times, I told you very important to understand and solve the study guide questions. And kindly, if you didn't understand any question, if you didn't understand any answer, don't hesitate to contact me or ask me at any time you are most welcome. 24 October, summative assessment. Also, we have a 25 October map test orientation. Kindly check our PC page. You will find one page, this one, this page, special for map test orientation. The map test orientation, very important for our students. Because you will check your level, you will check what you need, what you want to learn, okay? And for sure, we will explain more details about map test orientation, okay? The last day in this week, we will stay also with the same lesson, 2.3. We have more questions, we have more activities about this lesson. So by the end of this week, we have to be able, as I told you, we have to be able to talk about proportional relationship also you have to be able to determine whether quantities are proportional by testing for equivalent ratios 
by equivalent ratios. Kindly note that this lesson related to the last lesson because week seven, we explained already ratios. Here, we will determine the weather quantities are proportional by testing for equivalent ratios. See you soon and kindly. Always remember, I am here to help you all together, step by step to reach our goals. Goodbye.